So you've got to the point in the game now where you're going to need forged steel. And for love or money, you cannot get a crucible to make steel, right? Or even the schematic. Well, I'm going to show you a few things that you can wrench around the city and around the towns to get you your forged steel. Starting off, we have the chandelier. The chandelier will net you up to a maximum of two uh, forged steel. Uh, and you can usually find these in like larger mansions, you know, places that have like large buildings. You can find them in smaller like houses, but generally you're going to find these in like old Victorian houses and uh, fancy places like that. But the new city generation now for Alpha 20, lamp posts are by far the easiest way to get steel without having to get a crucible and uh, every single one of these like street lamps will give you a total of two forged steel and i mean you guys have seen it you've played alpha 20 you just have to go down the street and there must be at least like 20 40 50 lamp posts right so go ahead give them a range you do have to nerd pull up to the top and then smack them with a the wrench but there's so many it's so easy and if you're playing in a group you're gonna probably have like hundreds of uh, forged steel in them you know very very quickly so yeah lamp posts are probably the easiest and the quickest method to get the ingots that you need these are transformers so these blocks are new to alpha 20 uh, and you can usually find these types of blocks at um, substations or basically pois that look like substations it's basically things that look like they could have like electrical wiring and all that kind of stuff so these kind of um, transformers will actually have a total of three forged steel that you can wrench and they usually you can probably find like two three um of these blocks in like the substation so if you find them just give them a wrench and uh, they should give you a couple of ingots vending machines believe it or not also give you forged steel now this is not the one that is working these are broken ones if you try to wrench the good ones the ones that are working you're in for a shock literally as it will electrify you so you want to look for the broken ones and the only way that you can tell it's a broken one is that if you go for up to it uh, and you don't get like the option to click on it that's a broken one so all you have to do is give those a wrench and the vending machine will give you a total of three ingots so the five items here that I have in front of me will give you a total of four forged steel uh, if you can wrench them. It's up to four so you can get anything from zero to four, right? Uh, so we have here the ATM machine. These are dotted around in uh, the city. These are brand new to Alpha 20. So if you see those, uh, you'll have to break them first and then give them a wrench. The gun safe, again, you'll have to break it and then give it a wrench. And the same with the small reinforced lockbox, the large reinforced lockbox, and also the munition crates as well. So every single one of these will give you a total or maximum of four forged steel. If you want a little bit more, you can spec into salvage operations here in the perception tree. So I'm going to just wrench one now just to give you a baseline of what how many ingots you can get. So here we're going to get a total of four, which is the maximum you get without salvage operations. And if I just put some points into here and then into salvage operations, which nets me a um, basically a hundred times more, so twice as many uh more ingots so if let's see if we can wrench eight here yep yeah, we can get eight ingots right there didn't even need a third gun save so salvage operations does improve um the stuff that you get from all these items not just from cars so yeah so if you are struggling to get steel go around the city look for these items and wrench them whenever you see them steel is probably the um best resource to get uh, later on because you need it for like uh, steel crossbow bolts, um, reinforced blocks and then also for building the car in, in the end as well. So that's it guys so if you're ever struggling to get steel don't worry about it go around the city look for these items wrench away and then if you're really struggling go into salvage operations to get even more steel uh, for each time you wrench something. So if this video was helpful, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and I shall catch you in the next one, folks. Peace.